PlayStation sent over a review unit of the new PlayStation VR 2. A bunch of YouTubers has already made a video on this. I'm gonna give you my honest review. Even though they provided a review unit, all of my opinions in this video are absolutely my opinions. Now, of course, I had to bring a friend over and also Ishaman is in this video. And you are going to check out our first reaction to playing the new game Horizon Call of the Mountain. So you hit this button and you drag it out and put it on your head. Tighten, turn on the headset obviously with this button here. Oh my god. <laughs> now I see myself. There you are. Setting up the actual equipment is really easy. I only had to plug one cord into my PS5 and I was sort of ready to go. I also had to sync the actual controllers once, but then I was pretty much all set. Okay, so what I'm oh. seeing right now, the headset has a button under here yeah. that uh, makes you able to see your surroundings. If you yeah. are in game, deep in game, and you suddenly need to see your surroundings. I am really impressed that uh, there is no latency. Which way is it? Engage in physical activity, yeah. Engage in coitus. <laughs> this game requires you to engage in coitus. The headset has eye tracking. Do you see I'm not doing anything, but do you see the screen? How is that possible? It's eye tracking. Oh my god. My yeah. mind is melting. Do you see my Yeah, uh, oh my god. But I didn't expect uh, Horizon was the game that we were uh, going to play. <laughs> It's a new game! Look at the mountain! Are you seeing this? I'm seeing it on screen, but uh, of course I'm not seeing it from your perspective. Yeah, but I I'm... mean, it is something else. It's difficult to explain properly what VR looks like. Because you have to try it for yourself. Okay, so now we're starting the game. Oh my god! Look at my hands! And the headset has small earbuds. I can have one in so that I can still hear you. But look, if I hit the button under here and like, oh my god, I need to see my environment. Oh my goodness. Look at the leaves. When I tried the uh, Oculus Rift and all of that stuff, I kind of got seasick and uh, stuff like that. <laughs> look at this. Can you do this for 10 hours? I believe I can, I can live in this world. Oh my god! You wouldn't be like seasick or anything from playing this? Uh... I don't know because I need to actually do this for a ton of hours to actually, you know, know that sort of thing. But uh, so far, comfortable. It's a tiny bit blurry, but I think that has to do with the headset. You have to just tighten it and do the things. Now it looks sharper. I am struggling a tiny bit with the visions being a bit blurry. Now I found out that you have several ways, of course, to adjust your vision inside of these goggles. You have the back knob, you have the thing on the side, and you have the actual slider on the front. But I found that if I ever so slightly pushed it in and held it in place, I could actually find my sweet spot, which was my way of seeing the graphics the sharpest. And I have spent a lot of time adjusting the sharpness. Gonna have that mentioned. Oh my god! Oh. Well, it, it's like... Ah! Uh, of course, I'm sitting right next to you, so uh, I'm seeing it on screen, but... Uh, I know. You, you are underneath that thing right now. Yeah, there it's walking. It's walking over there, you see mm -hmm. that? You know, the 3D in this game it is actually mind-blowing so let me catch a grenade for you do you remember when we played horizon uh zero dawn yeah i pretty much uh, did everything in that game i'm pretty sure you did too yeah absolutely okay this thing is uh, like hmm <laughs> ah okay stay seated my elderly care <laughs> use your hands to climb oh you have to climb climb actually reach up oh actually reach up okay this is not lazy gaming okay <laughs> i get the picture oh help that guy let me give you a hand oh <laughs> no the fish <laughs> this is just too crazy uh, the most weird kind of thing is that uh it's so goddamn realistic realistic yeah i know right i'm just gonna take a little bit of time to watch the yeah, that's half of the experience watching the environment. And the pool ladder again. <laughs> Thumbs up it. <laughs> there we go. You have to actually use the trigger buttons. Oh, 
Now we're doing it. I have played a game similar to this actually. It was a friend of Ishaman. He brought, uh, I think it was Oculus Rift 2 or something. And I played a climbing game and I enjoyed it. That is like a year ago. So that is my previous uh, VR experience. I have to ask you, Yashan. Uh, is it possible to play uh, some kind of game with uh, dinosaurs or sharks? Because There are a lot of games in the PlayStation Store that are also free demos. So there are plenty of games to try out. There are currently not many games out for the PSVR 2. Unfortunately, which I thought, you cannot play PSVR games on the PSVR 2. I thought I could. So there will be no Skyrim in VR for me. I don't have the headset for that. This I... is actually working out. Yeah, uh, that was my uh, thoughts uh, too. Uh, it it Look. actually looks like... Uh... Oh, can I reach that? Can I jump? Oh. There we go. <laughs> I am actually climbing this stuff. Are you scared of heights? <gasps> Look at that waterfall. When you turn your head, I'm actually turning my, <laughs> oh my god. I know, it's so trippy. Yeah. Oh, but climbing feels so good. Wait, where am I going? Look, I have to like make sure that I hold myself here and then... Oh! <laughs> There's some. There's my friend. I think. Did you see him? What? He was running right there in the forest. Your friend? Yeah, my friend from the boat. <laughs> Neighbor gaming. The consoler was good. <laughs> Reach over your right shoulder to get something. I, I want to see dinosaurs. <laughs> it was a good game. The history was uh, good. Uh, and the music? Yeah, the music was, was good. Good? Yeah. Okay, okay, so reach behind me to get an arrow and I'm shooting it! Oh. That felt so good. You have to try this for yourself. Well, that uh, actually looked uh, really good. Uh, have you ever tried shooting a bow in real life? Yeah, like when I was 12 years old. Yeah. Boom. Oh! Oh my Sorry. god! Wait, there is a there is a thing over here. Sorry yeah. if I'm <laughs> neglecting my real life environment right now. But, okay. I think I'm uh, just as uh, immersed in this stuff uh, as you are. Really? Because yeah, this looks absolutely uh, crazy. It does look crazy, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, so put my guns away. Lol. Imagine playing first-person shooter games with this. Oh my god, Call of Duty uh, on this. Oh, and oh, Skyrim! Yeah. Skyrim VR! I'm so gonna get that! <laughs> so there will be no Skyrim in VR for me. A lot of what we are playing right now, that is a tutorial level of, you know, getting adjusted to the world of VR. Uh, -na -na. Oh, apple, 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 apple. Can I eat it? God! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so many things to interact with. <laughs> like, <laughs> tea party time. Look. Da -na 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 -na. <laughs> oh my god. Da -na 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 I'm not broken. Okay, Isha, uh, I'm gonna do something. <laughs> so. Do -do 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 -do. What the hell? Do you wanna do this? No, I'm, I'm just interfering. Da -na 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 -na. Okay, a new arrow. Ooh. Can you see that I'm holding my hand in? front of your... Nope, okay. I'm seeing the game, I'm in the game. This is too crazy. And we are climbing, I'm getting sweaty, this is a workout. Okay, do you see that? Yeah. Oh, I can't touch it. Okay, so we're... Can't touch this. A boom boom. Look at this. Oh. Oh, it's the heavy. It's, it's actually heavy, guys. Now it's going oh. to be yum. Oh, it's so heavy. Ba da dum. Oh. Bum. <laughs> uh, a more fitting song for this would be um, I want to get away. <laughs> I, I want to fly. fly. Did you make coffee? First of all, it's a makeup hugger. I recommend playing this without makeup on because it's gonna stain the inside so much. Now when it comes to that, I have to clean it properly down with alcohol wipes, which worked fine, but preferably wash your face before you play PSVR 2. Now I was playing for several hours yesterday and when it comes to long wear, I'm gonna unfortunately have to say that this is not for the longer play sessions. If you want a game, let's say eight hours in one setting, this is not 
it. Traditional gaming on a TV is the way to go for the longer sessions. Now that has also to do with it is so immersive. I got tired after one hour or two playing in VR because there's so many impressions and you actually feel like you are there sometimes. I mean you can still make out that it is a video game but it is virtual reality we're talking about. Also the headset you get tired from wearing it for more than two hours in one session. It is not really heavy it's just the way that it is put on your head and it's sort of tight I felt like I had to have it sort of tight on now when it comes to motion sickness and headaches I can only speak for Call of the Mountain which is the game that I played yesterday for several hours there are several settings in the game actually they have thought about this when you're starting up the game you get the choice between comfort something in the middle and veteran and this is actually for motion sickness and headaches and I went with prioritize comfort and then you can later on go into the options and alter it what it is doing actually essentially it is that when you're actually moving in game you get a wig net around you and that actually makes you less motion sick and at first I did not know what this wig net was I was like this is so annoying what is, what is up with this but you know what it had a purpose. You can turn that off. You can have your character walk slowly or fast. And also something that I was like, why is it like this? Is that when you're turning around your camera, it went into like a stop motion sort of movement. And I was wondering at first, why are they doing this? Again, it has to do with the motion sickness. I turned that off and I was like, oh God, whoa, I'm going back. So that was definitely the way to go. You can tinker around with this. Some people are more sensitive to become motion sick when playing in VR. And if you ever get motion sick, take a break. But if you want to play for a longer time, play in the comfortable settings because they are there in the game. Google is that. Maler. Se for det å lage skikkelig sånn artwork her. Det ser ut som du har null kontroll på hva fingrene dine gjør. Og det er liksom kokoracha. Jeg kokoracha. Se for deg om noen har malt hele jævla veggen. Det hadde jeg gjort. Men altså, det ser faktisk jævlig nice ut. Valdo ma fabile, valdo valverde. Det var hvis vi skulle vaske, så skulle det komme sånn musikk. Ok. Now my verdict of the PSVR 2. It is expensive. Now I was very lucky to get a review unit so that I could make this video. All of this being said, you gotta try this someplace, sometime. If you know someone that bought this thing, go over there and force them to have you try it. It is an experience. It is something new. You know, the actual headset, it even vibrates. And when I got that foot over me, the dinosaur walking over me in the river section, I felt a rumble on my head as if I got a drop of water on me. At the time, I didn't understand what that was all about, but it was actually the Rumble feature in the headset. I hope a lot of the original PS VR games get ported because I had a look around in the PS shop and I saw actually like a Titanic diving VR adventure game and I was like I want to dive down to the Titanic but that is not ported over as a PSVR 2 game so that is such a bummer that is like my biggest bummer right now that I cannot delve into that original library of games for the PSVR. <laughs> Thank you so much for all the merch also. Super awesome stuff. Oh, I forgot to mention PlayStation also sent over this charging stand. That is actually really convenient. I am liking that already. But like you just mentioned, we have been playing for almost an hour already. Yeah. And time flew by so fast. Uh, it felt like 10 minutes to me, but uh, it's like uh, an hour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And a hoodie. Looking good, do you want it? Yeah. Anyways, guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you later.